Have you ever wondered how a line drawn by a bureaucrat on a map could change the fate of millions? Welcome to our exploration of the partition of India and Pakistan in 1947, a momentous event that has shaped the course of history in South Asia. In the backdrop of this tale, we find India, a jewel in the crown of the British Empire since the 19th century, yet a jewel yearning for freedom. Two major political entities emerged during this struggle for independence. The Indian National Congress, representing the Hindu population, and the Muslim League, championing the cause of the Muslim populace. The 1940s saw the demand for a separate Muslim state led by Muhammad Ali Jinnah gather strength. As the winds of change blew over the subcontinent, Lord Louis Mountbatten, the last Viceroy of British India, proposed a plan in 1947. The Mountbatten plan, as it came to be known, was a blueprint for dividing British India into two independent dominions, India and Pakistan. The petition was based on religious lines, with Muslim-majority regions forming Pakistan, including East Pakistan, now Bangladesh, and the Hindu-majority regions forming India. The implementation of this plan triggered one of the largest mass migrations in human history. An estimated 10 to 15 million people crossed borders, seeking a place in their chosen nation. This migration, however, was tainted by horrific communal violence, with Hindus, Sikhs, and Muslims caught up in brutal massacres, rapes, and displacement. The human cost was staggering, countless lives lost, families torn apart, and homes and livelihoods obliterated. In the immediate aftermath, India and Pakistan grappled with the task of establishing new governments and institutions. Pakistan faced the unique challenge of managing two wings, separated by a vast expanse of Indian territory. The princely state of Kashmir emerged as a contentious issue, triggering the first India-Pakistan War in 1947-48, a dispute that remains unresolved to this day. The partition had profound and lasting implications. It altered the subcontinent's demography, society and political landscape, creating deep-seated hostilities and shaping Indo-Pakistani relations. The trauma of the partition has permeated generations, influencing literature, cinema, and the collective memory of nations. It triggered migration patterns that have resulted in significant diaspora communities across the world. In conclusion, the partition of India and Pakistan in 1947 marked the end of an era and the beginning of a new one. It stands as a prominent reminder to the human cost of political upheaval, and the resilience of those who survived, rebuilding their lives in new lands. The legacy of the partition is complex, reflecting the challenges of decolonization, the birth pains of new nations, and the enduring impact of sectarian divisions. It remains a pivotal moment in South Asian history, a line drawn on a map that has shaped and continues to shape millions of lives. Thank you for watching and subscribe for more.